Today, I'm preparing cabbage rolls. I have a medium-sized cabbage that I'm gonna remove three layers on the outside of this cabbage. Let's get started. With my knife, I'm gonna carve out the core of the cabbage. In a pot of boiling water, place in your cabbage. You're going to leave your cabbage in the water for about eight minutes. You're going to add some apple cider vinegar and sea salt into your pot and continue to let your cabbage boil. After eight minutes, remove a few cabbage leaves to make sure they are pliable to roll. Then remove the rest of the cabbage from the watcher and let it cool down. Next, we're going to start cooking our brown turkey. In my opinion, ground turkey is healthier than beef and pork, so I love cooking with ground turkey. In a pan, add in some oil and then place in your vegetables and saute them for eight minutes or until the vegetables become soft. Now that the vegetables are soft, then place in your ground turkey and chop your turkey up into smaller pieces and stir frequently to make sure it doesn't stick to the bottom of your pan. Cook your ground turkey for about 20 minutes. The ground turkey has been cooking for 20 minutes and now we're gonna add in our cooked rice and our seasonings. We're adding in black pepper, complete seasoning, garlic powder, Lowry seasoning, smoked paprika, and then we're going to combine all of these ingredients. At this time, let's preheat our oven on 375 degrees Fahrenheit. Pour in the alfredo sauce and mix it in with the rest of the ingredients. We're gonna let the filling cook for about 15 minutes and then we'll be ready to roll the cabbage. Now that our cabbage has cooled down, we want to start taking off our cabbage leaves and stacking them to the side. I'm 
I'm going to finish rolling out these cabbage rolls and I'll be back. Next, pour some Alfredo sauce on your baking dish to cover the bottom of the pan. Grab one cabbage leaf and cut the stem that was connected to the core. Then add two spoonfuls of filling. Then roll your cabbage leaf like a burrito and safely secure the ends of the leaf to keep it from opening. I'm going to finish rolling these cabbage rolls and I'll be back. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media platforms, TikTok, Instagram, and of course, YouTube. This baking dish is filled with cabbage rolls and now I'm going to add some more Alfredo sauce on top of these cabbage rolls and place it in the oven. Loosely cover the pan with foil and then place it in an oven on 375 degrees Fahrenheit for 35 minutes. I let the cabbage rolls cool down right out of the oven and now I'm going to add some more alfredo sauce and top it off with chives and I'm going to cut this bad boy open so y'all can see what the inside looks like. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit your notification bell and share my channel with everybody in your contacts. Wait, wait, wait. Let's be more realistic. Just share my channel with at least one or two people. Bye.